Hello students, good morning. Welcome in the English class with Sir Ratmo. Okay, now you can see that Sir Ratmo today is in your classroom. Okay, there are tables, there are chairs, and then there are things around me at school. Okay, now uh, because we study unit one about school. Now I want to tell you about the material of things around us. Look at the chair. Look at the table. It comes from wood. The material is wood. I have also here a ruler. The ruler comes from wood. The material is wood. I have another thing here like drinking bottle and then a cup. I have two cups here. One from glass and then another come from plastic. I have scissors and knife. You know what materials is the scissor and the knife? If you don't know, I will explain it today because our topic is what material is it. Now let's see. Open your book. Open your guest book. All right, students. Now I want you to open your textbook page twenty-two. On page twenty-two, you can see a picture, a picture of a house. Is it beautiful? Yes, the house is beautiful. Our topic for today is about what material is it. Now you can see the house. What material is the house? Is it from uh, a can? Is it from a glass? Is it from plastic? Or from wood? Which one is the answer? Yes, it's a wooden house, you know? Jadi rumahnya itu terbuat dari kayu, okay? So now, after we study about things at school, you can find out things that you have at school comes from what? Is it come from the plastic? It comes from the metal? It comes from the glass? Or maybe wood? Okay? We are going to learn more about the material of something or the material of things around us. Okay? Let's continue. Now, let's continue to page 23. Part 1, we are going to listen and say. Are you ready? Let's listen and say. Pupil's book, page 23. What material is it? 1. Listen and say. 1. Wood. 2. Plastic. 3. That's it. Okay, so look at picture number one. Picture number one comes from wood. Wood. Everybody say wood. Yes. Now look at picture number two. Straws comes from plastics. Okay, so this is straws. The things that we always used to drink. It comes from plastic. Next, number three is a picture of cans. Cans come from metal. Okay, metal. One, two, three, go metal. Yes. Next, number four. Look at the picture. It's come from glass. Okay. Can you say glass? Good job. Okay. 
that's it very good okay after we did part one about listen and say now we are going to go to part two watch the video this video will show you more about what materials the things around you comes from are you ready to watch the video let's check it okay so it's going to be a good video are you ready yes let's see All right, that's about a video about materials, okay? So now, after we watch the video, now we are going to go to part three. Look and say, wood, plastic, metal, or glass, okay? There are four pictures there. Picture number one is a colored pencil. Picture number two, it is a window or maybe it's like a plant house. Okay. Picture number three, it's like, I don't know, maybe it's a wheel of a bicycle or a motorbike. And then number four, it's a picture of a duck, a toy. Okay, now my question is number one, wood. Yes, it comes from wood. The material is wood. What about number two? Good job. 
It's glass. Very good. Number three, metal. Good job. And the last, it should be plastic. Good job, students. Okay. So now you know about materials. Okay. What things around you comes from? You know already. Now look at here. On page 23, there is a project. Draw materials in your classroom. Okay. Wood. It's a door. The door comes from wood. And then glass. It's a window. Okay. The window is from the glass. And then look at there. He drew a table, a chair, and then on the table there are some some pencil color pencil pencil color and then also a cup that come from plastics okay so because you are not in a classroom now because you are not at school now so i want you to draw materials in your house okay just draw the picture first and then write on the pictures the materials of the things you draw okay and don't forget draw it on your drawing book put the color and then share it to your teacher okay if you are from p1 angelus p1 bartolomeo and p1 elias you can send your uh, project to seratmo but if you are from P1 Dorothy and then a P1 Cleopatra, you can send your project to Mem Ida. Okay? We are waiting for your pictures. Okay? Thank you so much, students. That's all our topic for today about materials. See you next time in unit 2 about toys bye god bless you